है देख रहा के बाढ़ के तो रॉक आ रहा है Hey yo, guess is back, back again. Tell a friend. It's the fat man back with another video. Make sure to subscribe, comment, and share. Today we're looking at the steroid transformation of Rick Martel. During the 80s, jo Dr. George Zohorian, a ringside WWE doctor, states that the drugs were provided to enhance their performance and physiques, not for medical treatment. But he said he was unaware that providing steroids for non-medical purposes became illegal in November 1988, and he said that he carefully monitored the physical conditions of the wrestlers as a ringside doctor. Zohorian confirmed the testimony of Rick Martel, Roddy Piper, Brian Blair, and Dan Sp Spivey, professional wrestlers who said they bought steroids from the doctor. Such after such sales became illegal in 1988. Their wrestlers were not charged because steroids use was illegal at that time. Rick Martel was six foot and built two hundred thirty pounds. Rick Martel wrestled through the rock and roll era. He didn't make much of an impact considering the guy was huge. He was filled with growth hormone and various anab anabolic steroids. There are two reasons to believe he was on steroids. He wrestled in the eighties where steroids and drugs were encouraged. And the second reason being that he was just too big to be considered natty. He always had a good physique, but he really blew up around the mid 80s to late 80s when he started using the narcissist gimmick. Everyone with rugged physique in the era who had no gimmick or storyline would be given a self-loving, muscle-flexing gimmick, and most of the times it was a complete failure. You would think a guy with his physique would be a main event talent, but it wasn't destined to be. His absences on the WWE television were due to his wife being sick at the time, so he took time off to care for her. Arguably, costing him his position as Vince McMahon was not a time off guy in those days, whatever the reason.、Um, there's not much I can say about this person. I can't find many photos.、Um, most of them are blurred and old.、Um, But next week I will upload his steroids to natural transformation video.、Um, this was post steroid scandal, and you don't want to miss it.、Uh, make sure to subscribe, comment, and share. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.